Hello, welcome to today's technical analysis for Tuesday, February 13th, 2018. I'm Christina Barthenido, investment analyst at XM.com, and today we're going to look at the euro versus the Japanese yen on the daily chart. So we can see that euro yen could not extend uh, higher above the two, two and a half year high of 137.49 last week. And instead, it went all the way down, uh, breaking below this uh, long-term uptrend and falling uh, below the Chimoku cloud f after uh, quite a long time. So some corrections uh, might be around the corner. Uh, in the short term, the risk is to the downside. The RSI is in bearish territory uh, below 50 and is pointing to the downside. Uh, while if we look at the Ichimoku indicators, uh, the red tank cancel line has moved uh, lower and is on track to break below the blue Kinjusen line, but uh, we still need to see whether the indicators will post a bearish crossover before we confirm uh, these negative signals. Uh, now looking for support levels, if the market uh, moves lower, um, prices could meet first the 132 key level before they target a stronger support at 131.21, uh, which has been frequently tested in the past as support and resistance. Uh, the further below the next stop could be at the 200-day moving average at 130.79. Uh, however, if the pair heads to the upside, uh, immediate resistance could come at 133 uh, key mark. Uh, further above, we have the 134 uh, psychological level and the 50-day moving average at 134.50, uh, which if broken would resume this long-term uptrend, uh, opening the way towards 135 and a previous uh, resistance at 136.62. Uh, turning now to the medium term, the market uh, might turn bearish given that given that the market uh, is trading below the 50-day moving average, uh, while uh, if we look at the MACD, uh, the in index is gathering negative momentum below zero and below its signal line. Uh, so that's all from me. Thank you for watching and have a great day.